Arrange the following decimals then solve. Show your complete solution. So 2.34 divided by 0 0.4. So we multiply it by 10. So we have 4. The 0 0.4 becomes 4. And then 23.40. So we put the decimals in the same place. And then 23 divided 4 is 5. 5 times 4 is 20. Then we subtract 23 minus 20 is 3. Then we bring down the 4. So 34 divided 4 is 8. 8 times 4 is 32. Then we subtract 34 minus 32 is 2. Then we bring down 0. 20 divided 4 is 5. Then 5 times 4 is 20. Then this is 0. So we do the same thing here. This becomes 3. And then 45.6. So, we put the decimals here, so they have to be in the same place, so 45 divided 3 is equal to 15, 15 times 3 is 45, so this is 0, and then we bring down the 6, 6 divided 3 is 2, and 2 times 3 is 6, so we subtract, and this is 0. So... We have here, so we multiply by 10, so this becomes 12, and then 56.7. So we put the decimals there, decimal point. So we have 56 divided 12 is 4, 4 times 12 is 48. So 56 uh, minus 48 is um, 8. So we bring down the 7, so 87 divided 12 is um, 7, 7 times 12 is 84, so we subtract, so this is 3, and we can add 0, so 30 divided 12 is 2, 2 times um, 12 is 24, so this is 6, we can add more 0, so 60 divided 12 is um, 5 and 5 times 12 is 60 and this becomes 0 so next one 34 this becomes 34 and then 67.97 so we put the um, dot here so 67 divided 4 is um, 1 so this is 34 so 67 minus 34 is 33 we bring down 9 339 divided 34 is um 9 9 times 34 306 we subtract and this becomes um 3 3 we can add 0 330 divided um 34 is still 9 and 9 times 34 is repeating so it becomes 306 again so this is equal to um, so 4 then 2 and then if we add more 0 then it will repeat itself so this is a non-terminating quotient so that's number 4 and we do number five. Number five is um, seven point seven eight divided by three point two. So this becomes thirty two divided by seventy seven point eight. So we put the dot there. So it has to be in the same place so this is 2 and then 64 so we get 13 we bring down the 8 and this is 4 4 times 32 it's 1 2 8 we subtract so we get um 
110 and then we can bring down a, another zero 100 divide 32 is 3 3 times 32 is 96 and this be 100 minus 96 is 4 we can bring down more zero and this is 1 so 32 we subtract and 40 minus 32 is 8 and we can add more 0 so 80 divided 32 is um, 2 and 2 times 32 is 64 so we subtract and this is equal to 16 and we can add one more 0 and 160 divided 32 is 5 and 5 times 32 is 160 and we subtract and we get 0. So these are the answers.